Hey guys, so today I'm going to walk you through a super simple tutorial on how to use your iPhone to create text replacements and have those in place for things like your hashtags or email addresses that you paste all the time or your website URL or whatever. So this idea is not a new idea. Um, it's one that I wasn't using though until the Think Creative Collective girls mentioned that they loved it this way and I had just been copying and pasting my hashtags out of a notes file and this really is way easier and saves me you know if I post to Instagram three times a day then it's saving me probably a minute total but still it it's a minute out of my day okay um yes I am one of those people who has 93 notifications and does not care um so just ignore that if you're completely going crazy right now and then Let's get into it. All right, so on my iPhone, first things first, I want I have my hashtags copied in a notes file. So I wanna go in here and find them. I've already got them selected and I just wanna copy them. And ignore my notifications at the top of my screen. Okay, so I've done that. Now I wanna go into settings and go to your general settings. Sorry, I'll back all the way out so you know exactly how I got there. Go to your general settings and down to keyboard and then text replacement. And I want to create a new one with this plus sign at the top. And my phrase is going to be the hashtag bank. So that will be everything that I wanted to say. And let's say my shortcut is holla. All right, so now every time... I type the word holla, it's going to give me that text replacement and I just have to hit space. So I do that in Instagram. I have another Instagram account that I manage um, that is a local account. So it has a different hashtag bank. Um, so I have a different shortcut for that one. Another option would be to create a shortcut for your email address. So, you know, mine's fairly long because I have a really long name. Um, so I would put that in there and I'm just going to say email. Okay. So now when I go to type email, it's going to replace it, which is a really awesome thing. You can also do your URL. So That way you don't have to type it every time, especially if it just gets on your nerves to type something like that. And I'm going to do moi because, you know. Again, words that you don't use a lot are sort of the key here. Because if I've typed moi a lot, then it would constantly replace with ohheyjessica.com. And then I could just back out of that and type whatever extension I needed to. So I hope that helps you guys and I know it was really easy and yeah, you're awesome. Have a good day.